not taking nothing from him. He's a good fighter. Yeah. But I, I, just, I just feel as though they also also gonna be. And you, when you, and you look at fighters, when you look at fights like that, after you look at them over again, and just like you said, he was too far behind. Do you? Do you go back and say, man, I wish I would have did this early. I would have got that fight. I, I think if, if, if I fight him again, I, I know. Too. What would you do different now? I fight him. I won't move. I, so I, I, I take, I take him in the in the So you're saying in order to beat Charles, you gotta turn into a dirty fight? I mean, pretty much. I mean, fight, I mean, not not so dirty. Because I mean, if he's a power puncher, you, you want it. It gotta be. It's gonna be. A, it, it'll be a dirty fight, but it's gonna be a smart fight. Okay. Yeah. Not dirty like hitting. Hello. You have to be. Yeah. Dirty. When I mean dirty, I mean rough. Rugged. Yeah, you got so because I feel though no no other fighter that took him in the deep water. All the guys he didn't fought, he didn't really fight nobody that's solid. He didn't face adversity. He didn't fight nobody that's really really like. A, and, and at the time, I was in a 54 pounder. So you had to really bring the fight. I was in a 54 pounder when I fought him. I made making those pieces. But yeah. I was a 47 pounder. So you, know you were saying? coming up and winning. I, I just I came up. I had the USA title at 54. And that's what I fought Cholo. You know. Like I said, I take my head off to him. You know what I mean? I, Austin, I think Austin, Austin got the, the, the lead with this fight. You know what I'm saying? But if he do the right thing. If he do the right thing, if he's listening to Barry Hunter, and it, it, it sticks to the game plan, I think he'll get the win. But if he don't listen, it's going to either way.